Hello friends, it's Mike, and let's talk about the science of musical embodiment and why it may be crucial for developing our musicianship. If you're wondering why, it begins with our daily experience inside the craft of making music. Most of us experience performance stress from time to time. Most of us sometimes struggle with focusing in practice. Most of us are looking for entries into creative flow, and all of us are working to refine our musical expression. Everything from our rhythm, our tonality, our breath, our emotional expression, and our movement inside of music making. If that sounds like part of your musical craft, it pays to delve a little bit into the science of embodied cognition. And the basic idea here, in the context of music, is that musicality is built on brain systems that first evolved for other functions, such as regulating our own body function and connecting us to others of our kind. So think about your music making in this moment. Think about what you do. You keep a beat. You produce tones that produce feelings in others. You move your body in tandem with other bodies. And these things underpin the very things that make us human. And they evolved under those conditions. So the application of this for musicians today is that potentially priming and training these brain systems can help us improve our musical practice, our musical performance, and our well-being inside of music, our sense of being healthy and fully expressed musicians. So in a future video, we'll talk about which brain systems particularly like to get involved uh, in musical embodied cognition. Uh, but if you're interested in this topic, um, I linked us to a free article uh, entitled It Don't Mean a Thing If It Ain't Got That Swing by Richter and Ostevar from 2016. It's an investigation into the cultural uh, uh, sort of emergence of musicality, rhythm and dance, um, for all sorts of deep cultural reasons like um, bonding between people, like uh, ameliorating a conflict, uh, like pain relief or mood regulation. So check out that free article, and if you're interested, check out my class on Embodied Anatomy for Musicians. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you again in a future video. Bye-bye.